Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam Amma ba' The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said من صلت طريقا يلتمس به علما فحل الله له طريقا الى الجنه that whoever traverses the path of knowledge then Allah will make easy for him the path to jannah and when we look at the beauty of our surroundings here in this dunya this is a type of garden a type of beautiful some people would even say a paradise in the dunya think about the akhirah that if we make our intention for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, we strive to please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by seeking knowledge for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala about His religion, how to teach people about Islam, then that means we're traversing the path to Jannah. And that's the path that we want. But it takes ikhlas lillah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It takes striving for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we ask that Allah the Almighty accepts our good and forgives our evil and blesses us to be of the part of the Jannah, those people striving to go to Jannah, striving to seek knowledge and to do those things which the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam commanded and Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala commanded. And the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said in another hadith, Man yuridullahu bihi khayran yuthaqahu fi deen. Whenever Allah wants good for a person, He gives them understanding of the religion. So, if you can be someone to help the people to learn about the religion, to learn about Tawheed, to learn Fiqh, to learn the Sunnah, to learn the Seerah, to learn Tafsir, the explanation of the Qur'an, then you're on the path, you're in the Sabeel al Mu'mineen. you're helping others to get to Jannah, and you're on the path to Jannah, if your intention is purely for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and may Allah bless us with Ikhlas, with Tabat, wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam